Um, some other, like, random things that I threw in here. Things like evolution. People believe that to be true. That's sort of a... It's almost like a religion, because you have to accept it by faith. We believe that creation is true, and that God created the earth in six literal days and rested on the seventh. But we can't prove that. You know? We just believe it because the Bible says it, and we believe the Bible to be true. But the same goes with evolution, because like if you think about the Big Bang, or... There's this other theory, I don't remember exactly what it's called, but it's basically that the universe is constantly expanding and contracting and expanding and contracting. And for both the Big Bang and that theory, Mm -hmm. like the expansion contract theory, you have to have either eternal matter or eternal time. So that either means that time is eternal and rules everything, or that means that matter is eternal and rules everything. And the problem with that is that well, here's just something interesting is that both time and matter are humanly manipulatable. You know, we can take mm-hmm. matter and turn it into something else or destroy it or whatever needs done. And the same with time. AMC squared, totally weird. But the truth is that because of the speed of light, time and matter are changeable. They do change. They can be stretched if you do your math right. But anyways... So they are technically manipulatable, but when you think about God, God isn't really manipulatable. If you take him uh, 